Today I will show you how to make this hot color correction. Yo, hello, it's Povikas from Editing Visuals here, and let's begin. Alright guys, so the first thing you'll want to do is press Ctrl to white to make a new adjustment layer. And for this tutorial, I have a net spend music video, and the first effect we'll add on the adjustment layer is going to be Colorama. Now, this effect it looks kind of crazy just like this, but don't worry, we're gonna change a lot of it. So, the first thing we're going to do is go to Output Cycle, and use Preset Palette, and go to Fire. And already looks kind of dope, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, a bit too big of a contrast so we're actually going to go to blend with original i like to make it here to like 50 and already a pretty cool look in my opinion and you can already use this as a color correction this is how it would look like for example on this clip this is before and after kind of cool already but let's add more so another effect i like to add here is curves now add this below colorama if you have ever made a color correction then you have probably used curves and you've probably used the same graph as i'm about to use so i like to make one point here and one point here and this point just drag it down just a little bit and take this point somewhere like right there yeah so this is before and after kind of emphasizes that whole look this is already really hot and you can already save this as a preset if you don't have any plugins installed if you have some plugins for example deep glow then we can keep going so now we can go to effects and presets and type deep glow take it and drag it on top of curves but below colorama and now that is way too glowy so let's just turn down the exposure so really you can turn down the exposure to whatever you prefer i personally like the exposure somewhere from 0 0.10 to 0 0.20 so i'm gonna make it to 0 0.12 on this clip because i think it looks very good with it and just look that it's beautiful this is without and this is with that is a huge difference and this is without the color correction and with and the last adjustment i like to add here is another plugin that is kind of expensive but i really recommend to have it it's called dehancer if you have this plugin then you probably understand how good it is so let's add it on top of deep glow and it will already give this a look but let's go to halation press on enabled and now let's go to profile and make it to whatever this is and i also like to change the halation impact to 100 here now let's go out of halation and go to bloom and here also check on enabled and already that is a nice little impact and let's go to profile and change it to whatever this is 65 millimeters 70 millimeters and that's actually it guys for the color correction now you can add of course way more effects but this is how the color correction looks and this before it that is a really big difference and what we can do is we can actually save this as a preset as i have saved it right here as hot tc so you can go to one of the effects press ctrl a go to animation save animation preset and here we can call it like hot cc or hot color correction i don't know i like to call this hot cc and you can press on save because i've already saved it so i don't need to save it again and then whenever you want to add it you'll just be able to press ctrl y and simply drag and drop the hot cc very easy very simple and of course you can mess around like make more variations here as well like you can for example add press ctrl Alt Y on top of this adjustment layer right here and here you can just add like the answer and don't even change anything and look at the look you will get so yeah, that is another tip and another tip I would give you is to add just some cool effects below this to mess around you can add like CRT effects but I personally love to add opium effects so I actually have this opium presets pack which is a 40 plus presets pack that includes text effects glitches and just really dope opium presets that you see in these can Carson music videos I can show you some examples of the opium presets pack and this color correction so i can press ctrl y so i'm gonna name this to just hot because this is the cc and this is gonna be my opium so here we can just go to effects and presets and type opium and let's just scroll down to presets and see which ones we want to add so i'm pretty sure opium 11 v2 will look really dope below this one and that is a really crazy look this is how it looks actually without the hot cc so you get this darker look, uh, but this is worth it. You can, for example, add like Opium Free. This one enhances the glow quite a lot and just makes it look stunning. And this is how it looks without the hot CC. And yeah, you can just keep adding way more effects and these will work very well in your edits. And if you guys want to check out the pack, I actually have a $5 discount code, which is called Povikas. By using code Povikas, you will save $5 off on the Opium Presets pack. But anyways, guys, that's about it for this tutorial. Really mess around here a lot. I would really recommend to mess around more with the Hanser Pro profile like right here because you can get such crazy looks just with adding different ones so many different looks the possibilities are basically endless with this one i'm not even joking and if you guys want to see more of these videos then please let me know but anyways it was fun have a fun and productive day see ya